Hi everyone, welcome to Bog the Regis here in West Sussex, UK and England. On Sunday the 14th of July 2024, the day of the England maps versus Spain. What your guys thought? Who do you think gonna win? Could I fire you? I don't want to repeat as last time when the Euros were done. Remember? We got knocked out. I hope that doesn't happen this time. But yeah, this is Bob from Regis, everyone. It's currently sitting at 19 degrees air temperature. This is how clear the sea is. Sea temperature is around 18 degrees. Nice and warm now. The sea is at its warmest now. People who think otherwise are silly. It's warm. The air temperature as well is about. 19 degrees at the moment. It's lovely for shorts and t-shirts. People who say it isn't warm enough for shorts and t-shirts are wrong, but it's summer. As long as it's not raining, it's better than nothing. Alright guys. So, England versus Spain this afternoon. Kick-off is at 8 o'clock tonight. Um, all the pubs and bars around Bognor, Reinald City are going to be allowed to open till 1 o'clock in the morning. So, in a minute I'm going to go home and start drinking. I've got 18 cans of Stella at home, I've got a bottle of Jack Daniels as well. And what are the English people always do? We love to get pissed, don't we, while we watch the Euros. I remember the last Euro that was in first round tour last time. Watching the Euros with my friend David and Harry last time. I just don't want to repeat of what happened last time. So, finger crossed, England. You can bring it home this time for us. So, come on, England. Let the, what do you guys think the score going to be? I hope 3 0 to England and 1 0 to Spain. That's my prediction. But we all know that probably ain't going to happen. But yeah, we'll see what happened. Yeah, just out and about enjoying this weather. I'm sitting at 18, 19 degrees. As you can see, I've got my new t-shirt now. So my YouTube channel, Stuart Allen, the photographer and drum pilot. And also, on the back here, you've got my YouTube, TikTok, and all that channel there. So yeah, please everyone go subscribe to me, please. Also, please go subscribe to my mate YouTube channel called Cozy Music, please. But now my brothers, David Evans, and April Moon Band as well, please. And uh, yeah, let's go walk around Bogner. Show you what the atmosphere is for the game. So yeah, this is Bogner Pier. Not much on it. I prefer Brighton Pier than Bogner. That chic nightclub where you come out and smell in the evening. Or well, you want fresh air if you get too hot. In the summer normally you get idiots climbing up there and jumping off the pier. You've got fishermen fishing there. Doing their thing. Not my thing. You know. Sit there for hours of fishing, waiting for a fish. Like, what's the fun in that? Don't get it. But I do now because I went fishing on our white with Dean and Amanda, and it was cool. And I had cats off. And yeah, this is bogging up here, and this is where the idiots jump off here. They run and jump off here. But you can see the sea is clear, lot. See, it does get clear here. The sea, look at it. Nice turquoise colour, nice and blue. See, it's clear. Yeah, it's very light, the wind. It's perfect for the England match this evening. It's going to be a good one. It is. If you wonder why I'm down in town, because I had an optician, a test. I went for a checkup at the op Specsavers optician. And uh, apparently, my eyesight has got worse compared to three years, so I need to get some new glasses, so. And you go. Come out with your toy tank. Each to their own. I'll come out with my drone, he come out with his tank. But look at that water, look how clear it is. No joke. Look at it. See the sand. Let's see. People who say the UKC get dirty, it doesn't. 
does get clear, the sea just need to be calm for a little bit. So clear today, that you can see Brighton and distant over there. Let's see, Brighton right there. See the I three sixty in the distant, and you've got seven sisters and all that over there. Look carefully, you can see the offshore wind farm. But yeah, this will be later on tonight. I will be in this pub here. They're doing two cocktails for £10 and beers, yes, believe it or not, beers will be £3 a pint in the pub this evening where my friend work in that pub. And that will be this evening, what's an England game, what, instead of sitting at home. So yeah, that will be, but look, I'm glad the sun is out now. In my shorts and t-shirt but yeah come on england let's do this that beat spain i know i like going to spain but come on bring it home for us for once please prove us all wrong because i'll tell you now guys after this england game if we don't bring it home then that's it i'll give up watching football if we don't bring it home tonight oh my god smell those donuts smell lush yeah, this is Bognor Regis Seaside Resort. Nice cool breeze as well. Not bad. Yeah. Not much to film today. I just thought to do a quick update about the Euros. Yeah, should be good. But don't get your hopes up, guys. You probably won't win, but you never know. You never know. They might prove us wrong. They might prove us wrong. They might win, but I'm not getting my hopes up. You never know. Oh, that sun is hot. I feel that heat. It's lovely. At last, some sunshine at last. Not being sunny much this summer, is it? Yeah, that way I'll be later in there. So I'll try to bring you some video of the atmosphere from in there later. Kick off is at 8 o'clock. So yeah, that way I'll be later in there. So come on down, guys. It's going to be a good atmosphere in there later on. Come on, England. So, yeah, what are you guys' prediction? What do you guys think going to happen? I don't think we're going to do it, you know. I don't think so, but you never know. I reckon Spain will beat us. At my thought, because Spain has been playing really well recently. They have. But... They could prove us wrong and we might win but don't get your hopes up but it's coming home i hope i bloody hope so but yeah time to go home now and start on the beers my last day drinking until august so tonight Tonight will be my last drink, have an alcohol drink until August, last weekend of August when I'm going to be drinking again. So I might be going to our white or I might go out and see my brother in Scotland I haven't seen for ages. So I might go do that. You never know. I will see. Probably heard it is a good ice cream shop here, look. Really good, apparently, I heard. I'm not getting it, but I'm saving my money for the beers for later. For the shop. No, for the pub, I meant not for the shop, but I'm on about.
got rid of it but I'm a bit tired you know recently I've got to feel that heat from the sun about bloody time you come out the sunshine I've missed you a lot still getting brown as always so you've got Butlins down there and then this is where the town centre is this is film on the Sunday afternoon at what time is I don't know time is probably coming up to four o'clock I'd say the time is now lovely restaurants we've got here <sighs> come on England we got to do this but you know they're really in the hard rate over there that service hand but yeah they're really in the hard rate pub there where I normally go in and this is the town centre this is hope we don't meet into those boys again bloody bogner people Wait, pigeons, what are you doing? <laughs> so there, this is what Bogma is like. The town centre on a Sunday afternoon. In 20 degrees air temperature. Go and walk in the sun. So yeah, finger crop we will win. I bloody hope we do. It's sad if we did don't, but what people need to realise at the end of the day is just a football game, kicking the ball into a net, with guys running on the pitch. That all it is at the end of the day. So it's not end of the road if we don't win, just a game. People need to realise. So yeah, this is what Bog Maria Town Centre looks like. It's not the busiest, but Brighton is more busy. Southampton is more busy than Bognor. If I had a choice, I would move back to Brighton. My hometown will always be my hometown. That way I grew up when I was a little kid. So hopefully, I will move back there. Hopefully by this time next year, I'm hoping I'll be back living there again. That's my plan. Sport director on the white, where I go get my trainers and all that. And the pound shop there, where I think you do all the pound, it's depending on what you get. So, yeah. You know what would be good actually? I might do it this evening. Which I haven't knew that, I've never done on this YouTube channel. Maybe go around. I know people. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming.